He didn't have a heart. But he still got up. The page predicted all of it. It helped me fight him. Oh, oh, oh. He, he just disappeared? What the hell is going on here? We need to figure that out if we're going to do anything about it. Somehow we need to make sense of this. Saga was back at Cauldron Lake. Saga had to pursue Nightingale. Into the overlap. Finding a way in would be difficult. A ritual. Saga would learn how. Stop the monster. There is no rational explanation to what we just saw. I'd love to blame this on mass hallucination caused by inhaling volcanic gas, but we both know that's bullshit. This was supernatural. Well, I'm glad you were the one to say it. Now we can figure out a way forward. The victim of a ritualistic murder turns into a monster. Is there a connection? Looks to me like the cult of the tree is performing rituals to create monsters. Hmm, maybe. We need to start with learning this cult's goal, their purpose. Right before things got crazy, Sheriff Breaker just vanished. Maybe the Sheriff knew more than he was letting on. Hmm. He seemed anxious, like he dreaded what was coming. One more mystery. Hmm. Must be locked from the other side. Oh, that's the door, huh? Not opening. She have the keys. Is it just me or was that sheriff the guy that was from uh, Quantum Break? I think it was. dead man turned into a monster. Light as a way to fight him. Pages predicting the future. There's no rational explanation. This is the case we must solve. <coughs> it's kind of dusty in there. The cold of the tree is behind these murders. This case just became much more complicated. I'll need to start a new file. But it's my first cult case. Exciting. <laughs> Definitely not. Yes. How oh, nice that there's radios. Hmm. 
Hmm. The killers are usually the ones performing the ritual, not the detective. Acting out their sick fantasy. They may be trying to get you involved, forcing you into their twisted world. Don't imagine I would be profiling, but no. This mug always cheers me up. <laughs> it's a pretty good mug. Okay, so it wants me to look at the case board. Maybe. Uh huh. More manuscripts. Page places Nightingale back at Colgen Lake. Calls him a Taken. We need to head over there, stop him, before anyone else gets hurt. Okay. We, we heard gunshots, y'all okay? Did you get spooked by the bodies? Sheriff Breaker disappeared. Nightingale turned into some sort of a monster, and there are offices down. You two handle things here. We need to get back to Cauldron Lake immediately. Fuck me. That's terrible. We'll do what we can, man. Right. That's crazy, right, Thornton? Nightingale's heart was missing. How could he do anything? They're a fine pair. <laughs> what you thinking, Casey? Nightingale and his cult are dangerous. We need to be prepared in case things escalate more than they already have. Can you call it in, Casey? A smart choice, Anderson. Yeah, a Agent Casey here. Yeah. We need backup. The Bright Falls case. Whoever you can spare. ASAP. Think we'll actually find Nightingale at the lake? The pages haven't been wrong yet. We can't assume the person writing these pages isn't playing us. I agree. But it's our best lead. Such a small town. And repeat. Clock out, get a beer. Or maybe three. <laughs> I need to come clean, Anderson. I know why Nightingale was here 13 years ago. He was chasing a writer, Alan Wake. Tammy mentioned him. She's writing a book on his disappearance. You know the detective character from his books. Alex Casey. Yeah, I've heard the jokes at the office. Cold case Casey. Murder case Casey. <laughs> Sorry. Ha uh ha. -huh. It's the same name, similar job. It's the first thing anyone thinks of. It annoyed me, but that was it. Then, ten years ago, I started getting strange letters in the mail. Fragments of prose describing murders. You've heard the stories about what happened in New York. Some of it, at least. Bodies started to pile up. 
It was a murder cult. Turns out the fragments sent to me were from the crime books of Alan Wake. The cult was copycatting the murders from the books. In their heads, they were performing a ritual to bring Wake back. Their imagined prophet. After that case, I started looking into Wake's disappearance on the side. And you thought this case might be connected to him? His name does keep popping up. I just wanted you to have all the facts. Next time, give them to me before we find ourselves in the middle of a horror story. The page says Nightingale's in something called an overlap. Need to figure out exactly what that means. I'm happy I'm not in charge of this mess. Thanks. Let's start looking for Nightingale where it was killed. The writer of these pages knows what will happen. Because they're behind this, or because they can see what's coming. Impossible things are happening here. A world operating on different rules. I need to understand this strange logic. To see the clues. To solve the case. I've been thinking more about the cult of the tree. What sort of cult refers to themselves as a cult? In my experience, they don't. We're not seeing the full picture yet. Hey, hello there. How are you folks doing? Those restricted area signs don't do a damn thing, huh? <laughs> hello there. Hello. Saga Anderson. Are you two supposed to be here? I'm Ilmo Koskela. Fantastic to meet you. And yes, Stephen here hired me to show him through the woods. He's in town on important government business. Fixing this impressive piece of hardware. I work for the FBC, ma'am. I'm authorized to be here. And I bet you two are here about that murder. Nasty stuff. How's it going? How did you hear about the murder, Ilmo? Do you know anything that could help us? People tend to tell me things. The Koskala brothers are kind of a household name around here. Speaking of, uh, if you're looking for some fun, stop by Watery. Just down the road from Bright Falls, there's our Coffee World Amusement Park. There's Sauna, Sauna de Vista. <laughs> and we offer a variety of guided tours, hunting, fishing, hiking, whatever strikes your fancy. You name it, we probably got it. What is this thing? It's just a monitoring station, ma'am. The Federal Bureau of Control checks volcanic activity and air toxicity levels. No need to worry, though. It's mostly for research purposes. That's one gorgeous wetter saga. <laughs> Looks Nordic. I bet a family member made it. My mother made this sweater for me. How do you know? I knew it. My mom used to knit those sweaters for me and my brother. Watery, my hometown, was founded by Finnish immigrants. So between your name and the sweater, I figured your family might be from Finland too. Suomi, Finland. Ulla, Karjalan <laughs> Close. My mom's family is from Sweden originally. I don't know much about them beyond that. The sweater is just something to remember her by. Huh. Stephen, we're investigating a murder that occurred nearby. What can you tell me about your bureau? Nothing that isn't classified, I'm afraid. But I don't know anything about a murder. The operations here are run by a different department. I'm just here to make some repairs. The wiring on this thing frays every couple months. Yep, that's the raccoons. They grow real big here with teeth like you wouldn't believe. Can not run through a garbage can. Duly noted. That's all for now. <laughs> Let's get to the murder site, Casey. A lot of things about this case keep bothering me. But one thing feels really off. 
Breaker's disappearance. I don't get the feeling Nightingale was responsible. Hmm. He was about to give you more of those pages. Something didn't want us to have them? Or was protecting him from Nightingale? Spontaneous combustion? I don't know. I... Not the kind of disappearance we normally saw. Our crime scene's drowning. I never minded rain. Feels like home. No sign of Nightingale. But the page did place him at Cauldron Lake, in an overlap. So how do we follow him there? Maybe something around here will tell us. After we find Nightingale, what then? I've never arrested a monster. I've watched you arrest plenty of monsters, Anderson. You know what I mean. Monster monsters. <laughs> Light worked against him at the morgue. That might be the only way to stop him from hurting anyone else. Monsters? Overlaps? Rituals? What do you make of all of this? Mm -hmm. The killers are usually the ones performing the ritual, not the detective. Acting out their sick fantasy. <laughs> Magazine go. They may be trying to get you involved, <laughs> forcing you into their twisted world. But with dead men coming alive, the word ritual starts to have more weight behind it. We need to look around. Learn what this ritual is. All right, let's see what we got. We've seen this symbol before. Hmm. Good eye. Thank you. Can I investigate the beer again? I cannot. Is there anything over here? Bare feet. Nightingale. I'll see where these footprints lead. Can you come through the crime scene one more time, KC? Just in case. On it. If anything comes up, I'll radio you. I don't really see the trail marks, but... Oh. No, no I do. Okay. Ooh, it's getting darker. The tracks lead into the water. Where'd you go from here? To the lake? Possibly. Nice. I can feel something. <laughs> the presence. Nightingale isn't far. Give me all them goodies. is somewhere around Cauldron Lake. The tree was a threshold. This place and the dark place. <laughs> You're in over your head. Next stop, Caldera Street Station. The threshold, like a doorway, leading to Nightingale. It's somehow connected to a tree, which is Ladle. That makes sense. Yeah. I 
guess I gotta go back up here. Or I can't, that's fine. <clears throat> we'll just walk around. <laughs> The witch's ladle for all your spooky needs. Oh, I didn't. I didn't put two and two together with that. Um, <laughs> that witch. Can I put my hand through it and take a picture. Yep, that's a doorway. These aren't the same tracks that were here before. They're headed into the tree, not out of it. My flashlight burned the dark stuff away. It was covering... The fuse was in place. Saga stepped into the witch's hut. Inside, a bright light. There were objects that stood out to Saga, as if the light had manifested them. The witch's hut. Okay. I trust the pages to lead me to the overlap. Okay. In. Is Witch's Ladle the doorway into the overlap? If so, that's where I'll find Nightingale. Yeah. Light is the key. To stay safe. But for something more to be revealed as well. I need to find the Witch's Hut. Map. Oh. Okay. Must be that overhang of constantly walk fast. The witch's hut. Anderson, thought I saw something in the woods. Probably just a deer, but I'm gonna check it out. Okay, I found another page. Following up on a lead. Keep checking in. Roger. This fuse is busted. Better be safe there, Alex. I found said it was busted, so the one in that box is not the right way. Gotta have a fuse, right?
Let's see. Monday. Some suspicious activity. Fuck. <sighs> Reported. Uh, okay. I was a fuse, where would I be? What is this way? Oh, hang on, hold up. <laughs> there was a gun in there and I didn't even realize? Good thing I went to the map. If I miss that gun, there's gotta be the fuse in here. Excuse me, boxes. Locked. Great. This is just all sorts of fucked up. Okay, okay so that room's locked. A lunchbox again. Oh. Oh. Who's leaving these out here? Good question, but uh, we'll take it. Remember, it's just a bad day, not a bad life. Okay. This is a very pretty game, uh, and I would like to say I'm very glad uh, streaming my Xbox to my PC is working as well as I had hoped. Because uh, it was either do this or fiddle with an Elgato. And I'm glad I don't have to fiddle with the Elgato. Well, she did want to hike.
Interesting. Well, almost there. Might as well see what's up here. I have things to do. And this is not the right way. Oh, okay, okay. You know what? That's fair. That's fair. I'm glad the game's like, hey, idiot, get back on get back on task. What is goal? Uh get the light working. Yeah. I bet you if I'd walked a little bit further, I'd found a fuse. And I'm just, you know, just exploring. Mortar falls. I remember. We're gonna hack down. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because the thing was there. I bet you if I walked, like, just five more feet, that'd be... Right there. God damn it. There's another lunchbox. Yes, sir. Oh, right there is. Hmm. Alan is watching over us. This one looks good. People should really stop littering, though. It'd be nice. of the witch in the sign saga addressed the witch the smudged line on the heart the second part recited from memory i brought you the heart witch show me the terror saga pushed the heart through the hole in the sign Page from the witch's hut seems to be describing some kind of ritual or a witchable. Yeah. <laughs> 
I guess we just head back to that sign. Interesting. Oh, pop some painkillers like it's Max pain. What a trauma pad. Um. <laughs> Gears of War this. It's batteries. There we go. To get into the overlap, I need to find Nightingale's heart. Read the line imprinted on it, plus the line on the page to the witch's ladle sign. Then push the heart through the hole in the sign. Okay. Nightingale's heart disappeared from the morgue. Where is it now? I need Nightingale's heart to get to the overlap. Where is it? The cultist leaned close. He was there, but he was risen. Nightingale was there. The opposite of sunspots. Who said that? That's not it. I don't have what I need to find Nightingale's heart. There must be more. Nightingale's heart. Where is it? Meanwhile, they played cards in the general store. The witch had stolen his heart. Get out of my house. Nightingale's heart is at the general store, in a fridge. Oh. I need to check the general store for the heart. Casey, I'm headed to the general store. I think I know how to get into the overlap. Roger that. I followed some ATV tracks in the woods and got a bit turned around. Did you get lost? I've only been lost once in my life, Anderson. The years I spent with my ex-wife. <laughs> I'll find my way back, don't you worry about it. Don't forget to save often. Well, thank you. Okay. 
Check with Lady Fortuna at the counter. Painkillers. Give me it. The text on the heart is clearer now. Legible. Do I not need to take the heart with me? Sounds literary, but what does it mean? I feel like I recognize this. The fridge. The heart. I knew it would be here. Like I saw it in a dream. Fun. And now I need to give the heart to the witch. Makes total sense. Saga edged toward the broken door. Her gun ready. Flashlight aimed ahead. Nightingale said it would be here. The Cauldron Lake General Store was overgrown. Left to rot. Saga thought about the cult of the tree. They'd been here. Waiting. Planning a gruesome ritual murder. Meanwhile, they played cards in the general store. Like it was just another late night poker game. Saga stepped closer to the door. Had the animal broken it? There was a loud crash. Saga found herself face to face with a cultist. A hulking figure in a raincoat. We watch in the night. Wild eyes behind a plastic deer mask. An axe in his raised hand. Huh. So let's check. Let's see if I can find any numbers here. So it's seven. Oh, wait. Five. Th oh, so it's going to be seven, three, nine. Okay, duh. I don't know why it took that long for my brain to recognize that, but that's fine. I get a sawed off. Seven, three, nine. Quick slot that. Casey. Oh. In the area. They're taken, like Nightingale. Watch yourself out there. Yeah, thanks for the heads up. I'm still finding my way back. You have the worst sense of direction. <laughs> Any city in America I can get through drunk and blindfolded it's these damn trees okay okay i'm on route to witch's ladle i need to perform a ritual to open the overlap this case just keeps getting weirder but it is exciting true that oh there's a lunchbox <laughs> Knitting, huh? You have focus. Hmm. All right, where am I? Oh. Well, at least I wasn't horribly off path. Okay. 
Okay, not going that way. <laughs> What a nice night in the forest. All right, let's perform that ritual. Okay, <clears throat> let's see. drop easily. This is trippy. Casey, I think I'm in the overlap. Are you still on your way? Casey! Casey, do you need me? Fuck. Okay, Saga. Going in solo. Got two shells to my name. Logan? Logan! Where are you? What the fuck was that? Logan's back in Virginia. You're imagining things. Yeah, you know what? I don't trust the water. Is this... Right. It's not where I just came. Please help me. What was that? The Wait. Hell? Did I get turned around? No, this is right. This place is looping. A nightmare. Need to find Nightingale. The writer went into the lake, banished the dark presence. Taken still lurked in the woods. The dark place receded. The current pulled back those with darkness inside. Into the lake. Nightingale was there. One of them. The dark presence. Jagger had taken him. The witch had stolen his heart. They sank beneath the waves. The dark place. 
wandering in the shadows, muttering to themselves. It's dark. I'm lost. Where am I? Who am I? I can't remember. It's cold. Premium cabins for rent in Bright Falls. Who said that? Can you hear me? I need help. Please. Stop this. What did I do? You must dig it out. Their shape shifted. Echoes of the writer's dreams. Fading in, fading out. The next story and the story after that. The writer was writing again. Nice. Dealing with those damn crows again. <clears throat> nice. Gladly take some stuff.
least it gave me free shit. These goodies, thank you. I'm Saga Anderson, FBI. I can hear you. Cauldron Lake. Yes, I'm at Cauldron Lake. Where are you? Not to escape. In danger. The dark presence. Danger. Thanks. Got it. Are you okay? Oh, no! It's my fault! It got out with my face! Scratch! Sir, calm down. I'm gonna need you to take a breath. He's... he's changed the story. The dark presence. We must stop it before... Easy now. First things first. What's your name? My name is Alan Wake. I'm a writer. I, I've been... Wake? Where did you come from? You've been missing for 13 years. 13. Holy shit. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm going to use this moment to go uh, use the wash. I'll be right back. I lost my way 
my way 